On Monday, it was the pre-trial hearing during which Justice Burke laid out a timeline for the Weinstein criminal trial, which has been much anticipated uh, because really this case has been at the centre of the Me Too movement. Indeed, uh, allegations made some two years ago by the New York Times uh, and the New Yorker uh, uh, from accusers of Harvey Weinstein were what sparked the Me Too movement in the first place. So this trial is being very closely watched. He is accused of five sex crimes, including rape. And if he is convicted on all those charges, then he could face life behind bars. Weinstein, the 67-year-old disgraced movie producer, arrived at this New York courtroom using a Zimmer frame. Uh, his uh, accusers and critics say that he is trying to make himself look as feeble as possible ahead of this trial uh, and as uh, unlike a sexual predator as possible possible. Uh, some of those who have accused him of uh, sexual harassment or abuse uh, stood in front of this courthouse today and spoke out against him. They talked about the importance of this case for the Me Too movement. Time's up on sexual harassment in all workplaces. Time's up on blaming survivors. Time's up on empty apologies without consequences, and time's up on the pervasive culture of silence that has enabled abusers like Weinstein. We're at a time where, um, especially the next generation, those younger than us, are not going to put up with what's been going on. The trial proceedings are expected to go on for some two months. The initial stage will be the jury selection, and that should take around two weeks.